Yo, what's up all you action figure lovers out there? Master Marvel's back at it once again. Bringing you, know, <laughs> bringing you another action figure review of the DC Multiverse Wonder Woman wave. And again, we have here Wonder Woman. And she's in her home world dress attire, I guess. Uh, and that's, that's pretty much what we'll call it. Diana of Themskra. I didn't pronounce that right, and I'm not even going to try to do it again because I won't get it right no matter how many times I try. Uh, yeah, I mean, I don't know. Uh, this one has a better head sculpt, I think, than some of the other ones have been, but it's still not right. It's not really there yet. But we're going to get her open anyways. Check her out. Oh my god, just look at that sword already in there. It's like way, way bowed. Just look at it there in the package. You can see already how crooked that is. Love it. So here we go. All right, we got the lower crotch piece and thighs of Aries. We have rubber bands. Really? I can't emphasize enough how much I hate these stupid things. But apparently, to Mattel, it was necessary. I ain't worried about bending this one because it's already. Look at that. Look at that. I think they need to fire their blacksmith. Get off of here. Okay. Well, heck, she has a bicep swivel. I'm shocked. Usually Mattel just likes to keep that all in the elbow. I mean, it's still there, it looks like. Yeah, the... So, I don't know, man. This is, uh... And there's nowhere even for her to keep her harness. Or her... Excuse me, her lasso. I guess she can hold it, like, okay. So just keep that in her. It's a very soft, pliable plastic, so... But I feel like if you're not careful, it will tear easily. And then this all bent up, beat up sword, which is actually different than the one. It's quite a bit different than the other one, really. I guess it's just a training sword, I don't know. But it's got some cool writing on it and stuff, like some... I don't know, some inscribings on there that probably say something myth mythical, but, you know. Oh, wow. Good luck getting this one in her hand. It's tough. Anyways. One of these days, I just like to take like all the swords from all of my different six-inch figures and put them all together in like an armory and just see what I come up with. All the different swords, because I mean, Lord knows I got a lot of them. No ankle pivot, of course. And this skirt piece is really—it feels like it's soft in the front, but thicker and harder in the back. I don't know. It definitely hinders the articulation on it. And for God's sakes. Ab crunches on these would have went a long way. But here she is, out of the package. Doesn't look bad. I mean that, you know, profile wise, that doesn't. That's that's kind of got her profile there. I mean, it's it's not terrible, but it's still not great. Can't wait to get to like the. Uh, at least the Justice League, Justice League wave, because then, you know, you got a little bit better. 
uh, sculpts on the, the faces and stuff by then. So that would be where my preferred figures come from, from the uh, cinematic DC people. Yeah, I always want to say MCU because that just flows right off the tongue, but what do we say? The DCU, I guess? I mean, I, I guess, yeah. Or, or the DCCU? DC Cinematic Universe? I don't know. I mean, it just doesn't roll off the tongue very well. So, anyways. Again, not much to say about this old outdated crap other than we have it. It's in our collection. It's going to look good somewhere, I guess. Just kind of standing there on the shelf. But to get some good dynamic poses and pictures out of these, you know, you're, you're setting yourself up for failure, man. It ain't going to really happen. So, that being said. But the one thing I do have to say about this, though, that I am pleased about, okay, is the shoulders on here. Uh... I was really dreading that because on the back of the, the product shot, if you can get a look there, you see in her shoulders there, you can see the round pegs visible. It's not the case with the finished product. I was worried about that and <laughs> I didn't really look at it, but I mean, if that's the way it was, it would have been really disappointing, but so at least we don't have that, you know, so I don't know. got me speechless right now because there's just nothing else to say about it so I will say this I hope you guys liked my video don't forget to like comment and share and you're checking out Master Marvel on YouTube I am Master Marvel 80 do not forget to subscribe to my channel I will catch you guys later peace